Welcome back to Max Reaction. How are you doing this evening, this night, this day, whatever it may be? How are you doing? Comment down below, let me know. And let me know what part of the world you're from and uh, what city you're from, if you're willing. Anyway, we've reacted to military, Philippine military, you know, that's been on Korean soil, that's been on, of course, Philippine soil, and we gotta honor the people that's been on serious soil. So this was recommended to me, uh, re rec I forgot how to talk, recommended to me, um, and this is the Filipino soldiers in Syria, EOD, Explosive Ordnance Disposal is what EOD means, I do believe. So we gotta honor the Filipinos that are fighting over in Syria, um, saving lives over in Syria, risking their lives in Syria. Um, we need to honor any Filipino that's put foot on any foreign soil and their own soil. So let's go ahead and check this video out. It was recommended to me, not sure what's on it. So let's, let's, let's do this. In 2013, a Philippine contingent as part of the United Nations Disengagement Force played a vital role in securing the lives of those caught in the middle of the Syrian Civil War. It was during this time that rebels started attacking UN positions by placing landmines and roadside bombs. That's... That's so, so horrible. Golan Heights, Syrian side. Nadeploy ako ng ng Syria at saka Israel. Nung nasa Syria kami, maraming mga EOD na. Mayroong wow. Austrian EOD. May Fiji Battalion na EOD. May Ireland na EOD. Pero nung nagkaroon ng situation doon na mayroong isang, Bombs situation, everywhere. isang kampo na napaikutan ng roadside bomb, kinausap kami ng force commander ng UN. Irish. Kaya niya bang recover rin yung bomba na yan? Sabi ng mga Irish na, we have the equipment, but our personnel are not trained to do that. Such a dangerous so yung PT, job. Mga PT, walang alam niyo mga PT na yun. Ako ang nagtuturo sa kanila eh. So definitely hindi nila kaya. Yung mga Austrian, ganun din, we have the equipment, but we do not have the experience na gawin yan. Ang tinanong ako, sabi ko, sir, we, 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 we do not have the equipment, but we have the experience. So, kanya, but we can do that, we can do that. So, Yung force commander, tinatanong kung sigurado ba ako, sabi ko, eh, sir, we can do that. So, tawag siya sa batalyon. They can do it all. Kung seryoso ba daw ako. Sabi ko, sir, kaya yan, sir. Seryoso ka ba ng kinakailangan ko. Bigyan mo ko ng security. Banata natin, sir, yung element of surprise. Paliningin natin ang nagdasal, sir, yung mga rebuild doon. It makes me nervous just watching. Like, these guys, these guys are heroes, too. To the Filipino people and the Syrian people. And the world, really. Much respect, much respect. Natutula napakahirap na ano eh. Napakahirap eh. Yung baka yung parang yung judgment call mo nung nung sa mga ganong sitwasyon. Uh, pwede ka naman magiging ordinary ano ka na lang, di ba? Pwede mo namang iwasan yung risk na ganyan. But may mga times talaga na nandyan ka na na doon mo naman masusubok yung sarili mo eh. Ako, naman sa field ako, risk taker ako eh. Alos lahat ng risk tinitake ko pero Sabi ko nga sa tropa ko, pag nag-tipik ako ng risk, There's a lot of Sigurado ko mananalo ako, hindi ko matatalo. Okay, huwag na. Look at all those. Wow. Super important part of the military. Ano ang sinisimbolo niyang... Ako naman, sa akin is yung ingenuity ng mga Pilipino. Yes. Na ang Pilipino, very resilient tayo, very innovative. Na... Lahat ng problema na i-encounter natin, walang mga bibigat na problema sa atin pag Pilipino. Kaya Pilipino ka eh. Huwag mo sabihin na mga hindi mo kaya yung problema, ang silbi na pagkala Pilipino mo kung hindi mo kaya yung solusyon na yan. I agree with that. Not a problem that you cannot solve. Even if it comes down to not having the correct equipment. Hold on. Not having the correct equipment, a Filipino's gonna, gonna fix the problem. I mean, they, they, they 
prove it over and over and over and over again. So, what that man said holds true. But like I said, heroic, not only, you know, on Korean soil, Filipino soil, on Syrian soil, and who knows what else soil. If there's any more where, where there's been heroes from the Philippines that served on other people's soil that did heroic things, let me know. Uh, let the comment section know. Let other people know. This is like a learning thing, you know. I'm learning so much through these videos. And I keep getting comments where other Filipinos said I had no idea about, you know, whatever I might be reacting to. I'm learning. So we're all learning. So your comments are very, very important. So comment down below. Let me know what I should be reacting to next. I'll try to get to it. If you want, hit that subscribe button. Become part of the Max Reaction family. Uh, sharing the video would be awesome. So share it. And I'll see you next time. Peace.